The ocean is talking, and if you listen closely, you can almost hear the whispers of what's to come. Each winter, the world's largest body of water sets the tone for the season ahead, sending signals that ripple across continents and shape the weather we all experience. This year, La Nina is the headline act, taking center stage in the global climate theater. Its influence is powerful, and its effects are already being felt in subtle shifts and dramatic changes alike. La Nina means cooler than average sea surface temperatures in the central and eastern Pacific Ocean. These cooler waters don't just stay put, they set off a global chain reaction, altering wind patterns, ocean currents, and the very rhythm of the atmosphere. This cooling shifts the jet stream, that fast-moving river of air high above us, steering storms and cold air into new, sometimes unexpected paths. The result? Weather patterns that can flip from calm to chaotic in a matter of days. For North America that means a storm track locked in for some, bringing relentless snow and cold, while others may see a dry, mild winter with barely a flake in sight. The contrast can be dramatic, even between neighboring regions. But La Nina's reach is truly global, impacting Asia's monsoons, intensifying droughts in South America, and even influencing the gray, unsettled skies over Europe. No corner of the world is left untouched by its sway. This year's moderate La Nina is the main engine behind our long-range forecast for the US, Canada, and Europe. Meteorologists are watching closely, analyzing every shift and signal to predict what's next. Expect a season of extremes, some regions will be buried under relentless snow and biting cold, while others stay unusually dry, with landscapes left bare and waiting for moisture that may never come. The active storm track could bring major snowfalls and sudden cold outbreaks to millions, disrupting travel, daily life, and even the rhythms of nature itself. Meanwhile, drought concerns grow for those left out of the storm path, Farmers, city planners and communities are already bracing for the challenges a dry winter can bring, from water shortages to stressed ecosystems. The atmosphere is primed for a memorable, impactful winter, one that could test our resilience and adaptability and remind us of the power of nature's cycles. Get ready, the stage is set, the spotlight is on, and La Nina is calling the shots for winter 2025 to 2026. The only certainty is that this season will be one to watch. Snow lovers in the Northeast and Midwest, this is your year. The upcoming winter is shaping up to be one of the most memorable in recent history, with forecasts pointing to a season packed with dramatic weather events and relentless cold. If you've been waiting for a true winter wonderland, get ready, your wish is about to come true. La Nina's storm track is setting its sights on the Great Lakes and the interior Northeast, funneling a steady stream of moisture and Arctic air right into the heart of these regions. This unique setup means more frequent and intense storms, with the potential for record-breaking snowfall in some areas. Expect frequent nor'easters for cities like Boston, New York, and Philadelphia. Feet of snow, high winds, and coastal flooding are all on the table. These powerful storms can paralyze cities, shutting down roads and transit, and leaving neighborhoods blanketed in deep snow for days. The Midwest, from Minneapolis to Chicago and Detroit, is in for above-average snowfall and persistent cold. Residents should brace for long stretches of sub-zero temperatures, icy commutes, and the constant hum of snowplows working overtime to keep streets clear. Fast-moving Alberta clippers will reinforce the cold and build a deep snowpack. These quick-hitting storms can drop several inches of snow in just a few hours, making travel hazardous and keeping winter sports enthusiasts thrilled. The Great Lakes, slow to freeze this year, will fuel intense lake-effect snow for cities like Buffalo, Syracuse, and Cleveland. As cold air sweeps over the relatively warm waters, snow bands will set up and dump feet of snow in narrow corridors, sometimes catching communities off guard. Early season cold over warm lakes could trigger historic snow events. The contrast between frigid air and unfrozen water creates the perfect recipe for blinding snow squalls and whiteout conditions, especially in November and December. Arctic air intrusions mean more days below freezing and bitter nights. Prepare for wind chills that can dip well below zero, making even short trips outside a challenge and increasing the risk of frostbite. Heavy snow and relentless cold will disrupt travel and daily life. Expect flight delays, school closures, and the need for extra caution on icy roads. Winter will test the patience and preparedness of everyone in its path. Prepare for a long, tough winter, snow tires, salt, and a working furnace are musts. Stock up on essentials, check your heating systems, and make sure you have emergency supplies on hand for when storms hit. The signals are clear. Winter is coming, and it means business. 
This is not the year to be caught off guard or underprepared. Stay alert, stay prepared, and get ready to shovel. Teamwork and community spirit will be essential as neighbors help each other dig out and stay safe. This winter will be one to remember, a season of challenges, beauty, and unforgettable moments across the Northeast and Midwest. Skiers in the Northern Rockies, rejoice! La Nina is delivering. The Pacific Northwest and Northern Rockies will see relentless storms and deep snow, with resorts like Jackson Hole and Big Sky measuring snowpack in yards. This is a classic setup for an epic winter and a crucial boost to the region's water supply. In the Appalachians, Miller B storms will bring heavy, wet snow to higher elevations from West Virginia to New England. Resorts like Snowshoe and Stowe are primed for a stellar season. Persistent cold and an active storm track mean more natural snow and great snowmaking conditions. After recent dry years, this winter could help ease drought and wildfire risk. Both mountain ranges are set for a long, snowy season. Perfect for winter sports and local economies. Powder days are coming, get ready. While the north braces for snow, the south and southwest face a different challenge. La Nina's jet stream blocks storms from reaching California, Arizona, and New Mexico, bringing below average precipitation and warmer temperatures. This spells trouble for regions already battling drought and raises wildfire risks for next year. The Deep South, including Texas and Florida, will also be warmer and drier with fewer rain events. California's snowpack will suffer, threatening water supplies and agriculture. The Sierra Nevada may see one of its driest winters on record. Pleasant winter weather comes at a cost, water shortages, and fire danger. The Southern Tier's mild winter is a stark reminder. Less snow isn't always good news. Focus on water conservation and wildfire preparedness. Two winters, one nation, snow in the north, sun in the south, stay vigilant and plan ahead. The central U.S. is the winter battleground, where Arctic air meets Gulf warmth. This clash won't always bring snow, but it sets the stage for dangerous ice storms. Freezing rain and sleet could hit the central and southern plains hard from Dallas to Kansas City. Even a thin layer of ice can cripple power lines and make roads impassable. Temperatures will hover near freezing making every storm unpredictable. Rain, ice or snow could arrive with little warning. Forecasting here is a challenge. Residents must be ready for anything. Prepare emergency kits with essentials in case of power outages. The region's infrastructure is vulnerable to ice. Plan ahead. While the north shovels and the south basks, the heartland faces the ice. Respect the threat, stay informed and be prepared. This winter, vigilance is key. Canada's winter will be a tale of two halves, classic La Nina style. Western Canada, BC and Alberta will see relentless storms, deep mountain snow and persistent cold. Ski resorts like Whistler and Banff are set for a phenomenal season. Arctic air will spill into the prairies locking Saskatchewan and Manitoba in a deep freeze. Expect well below average temperatures and snow that lingers for months. Eastern Canada, including Ontario and Quebec, will have a more variable winter, active storms but with thaws and refreezes. Atlantic Canada could see big nor'easters and significant snow, the prairies get the brutal cold, the west gets epic snow, and the east gets volatility. This coast-to-coast -coast split is La Nina's signature. From powder in BC to storms in Newfoundland, Canada's winter will be dynamic and demanding. Bundle up and prepare for a season that tests endurance. La Nina's mark will be felt from coast to coast. La Nina brings a different story to Europe, generally milder and drier than average. A positive North Atlantic oscillation means strong westerly winds, keeping cold air locked to the north. The UK, France and Germany will see fewer cold snaps and less lowland snow, rain is more likely. The Alps will get snow at higher elevations but lower resorts may struggle. Scandinavia is the exception. Norway, Sweden and Finland could see a colder, snowier winter. Local surprises are possible but the dominant pattern favors mild, windy conditions for most. The main concern, windstorms, not snow. Europe's winter will be less about deep freezes and more about staying dry and prepared. To truly understand what this winter has in store, we need to look at the three major players shaping our weather, La Nina, the polar vortex, and the stratosphere. Each of these forces acts like a piece of a giant atmospheric puzzle, influencing not just local weather but entire continents. La Nina sets the stage by shifting ocean temperatures in the Pacific, which in turn alters global wind patterns and jet streams. This often means colder, snowier conditions for some and drier, milder weather for others. 
But La Nina is just the beginning of the story. The polar vortex, a swirling mass of cold air high above the Arctic, can either lock in frigid air or unleash it across North America. When the vortex is strong it acts like a lid, keeping the cold bottled up near the pole. But when the vortex weakens, especially during La Nina years, it can wobble and send blasts of Arctic air plunging southward, leading to sudden cold snaps and major snowstorms in places that might otherwise be mild. Then there's the stratosphere, the wild card in this wintry mix. Sudden stratospheric warming events or SSWs can disrupt the polar vortex entirely, flipping the forecast on its head in a matter of days. If an SSW strikes, regions that were enjoying mild weather can suddenly find themselves in the grip of extreme cold and heavy snow, catching many off guard. These powerful atmospheric forces interact in complex, sometimes unpredictable ways, shaping not only the intensity of the season, but also delivering surprises that can challenge even the best forecasts. Our outlook for this winter? Expect snowy and cold conditions to dominate the north with frequent storms and deep freezes. Meanwhile the south is likely to see drier and warmer weather, with fewer storms and more mild days than usual. But remember, the polar vortex and the stratosphere hold the keys to any extreme shifts. A sudden change in either can rewrite the forecast overnight. These wild cards can change everything, making winter forecasting both a science and an art. The dance of these forces is what keeps meteorologists on their toes and makes every winter unique. We're watching every move, every shift, to keep you ahead of the storm and ready for whatever winter brings. Here's what you need to know for winter 2025 to 2026. Expect snowy, cold conditions in the northwest, Rockies, Midwest and Northeast, dry warm weather in the south, and a volatile mix in the central US Canada faces a classic split. Epic snow in the west, brutal cold on the prairies and stormy variability in the east. Europe will be milder except for a wintry Scandinavia. Preparation is everything. Service your snowblower, stock emergency kits and have a plan for power outages. Stay tuned to local forecasts. Conditions can change fast. Whether it's snow, ice or rain, being ready is your best defense. Stay safe, stay informed, and we'll be here tracking every storm.